And uh, welcome to the Invent Geek Air Cannon build. This is a quick overview video here, just so we can demonstrate a few things. So here we have our completed cannon. Um, we have our feed line coming in to a valve. This is the original valve that was on the tank. We can see here somewhere that we have about 40 pounds, 60 pounds, somewhere in there. That looks like it's about 60 in the tank. We have our solenoid valve right here. This is a 12 volt solenoid valve and this goes down to our air compressor. Now our air compressor is off. What we're going to do is we're going to come down here and we're going to close the valve on this tank. And this is kind of specific to the Harbor Freight tank. And with that nice and snug we're just going to disconnect our air supply. There we go and our cannons ready to fire um, a little confetti in there just so we can make sure you all see it at home there we go so let's see what this thing does three two one <laughs> it's loud it's scary it's obnoxious it's a hell of a lot of fun so, more or less, there you have it, you know, we've got a $19 tank from Harbor Freight. We've got an air horn valve, costs us about $20, $25, and then we have just a simple fitting um, and some cast iron plumbing fit pieces to connect all these together, and of course some just simple PVC. So, there you have it, Invent Geek Air Cannon build. Uh, we hope you enjoyed this. Uh, go to inventgeek.com and you can see a whole lot more. How to build this, parts, plans, the whole nine yards. Thanks.